Hey everybody, welcome to another What the Heck Wednesday. This week I'm doing my video on gluten and candy, and that's just because Halloween's coming up and Trick or Treat is coming up too. And um, just to give you a better idea of what you should be aware of with gluten and um, what it could be hidden in and what candies you should be aware of and just what candies are safe as well. Um, as you can see, I'm already in a costume, which I'm not sure what I am, and I'm even though I'm 16, I don't go trick or treating or any of that, but I just thought maybe get a little festive for this video. Um, but I'm just going to start off with uh, glu candies that do contain gluten that you should completely stay away from. And I'm gonna I'm just going to list off some of the main brands, and I know there's a lot of candies, but I'm just going to list off the main ones that do contain gluten first. Um, one of those would be Milky Ways, which I know that's the big one that a lot of people may not consider. And also Nerds, which Wonka Nerds, which you may, that's one a lot of people don't think about and it's one you should be um, careful of. Uh, licorice is another one, like red, uh, Vines, um, the Red Vines, the, what's it called? Um, just licorice in general and Twizzlers and all that. And also, any Wonka bars is something you should be aware of too and completely stay away from. And um, that's just something you should be aware of. And Altoids, which are like the mints, which they may you may see given out, and those are something you should avoid. And Hershey's Special Dark Chocolate is something you should avoid as well, which those are some big ones that you should um, be careful of and you should completely avoid in general, which I've noticed that... Um, those there's a lot of obvious ones out there that you should avoid but those are ones that are kind of a little harder to figure out um, that I just thought I'd name off um, some that are safe that you may be a little worried about that are like big brands that are okay um, I'll just list some that are gluten free and safe to have those would be M&Ms um, all flavors except pretzels obviously Snickers Three Musketeers Sour Patch Kids um, Reese's peanut butter cups that aren't seasonal, Rolos, so Rolos are safe, um, Swedish Fish, Sour Patch Kids, and any Tootsie Roll products. So really there's a lot you can have that um, you you can have on Halloween and Trick or Treat that's completely safe and um, I'll put a list below and I'll also link to a gluten free candy list if it would help but I just thought I'd name off the bigger brands that you may uh, want to know about. Um, the last category I'm going to go over is just candies you should be careful of that say they're gluten free but just you should be more aware of and Butterfinger is definitely one of them which the only um, size, which this is weird, the only size that is gluten free is the normal Butterfinger size and almost all the, actually all the other sizes are not gluten free. So even though the one Butterfinger size is gluten free, just they're probably made in the same facility of the others and that's kind of risky to mix up with your kid or yourself um, which one's gluten free or not. So Butterfingers, I would be extremely careful if you're going to try it and I, if I were you I'd just avoid it in general because it's kind of too much of a risk in my opinion. Um, Smarties are another one which they are made in a gluten or in a facility containing wheat and um, they're just something you should be aware of because there could be a chance of cross-contamination and such and just things you should be careful of. Um, those are the two biggest ones and oh also Reese's peanut butter cups if it's not the normal size if it, um, and it's a seasonal or maybe like a pumpkin shape or something for Halloween then it's not gluten free so just be careful with the different sizes and the different um, the just the different types of Reese cups you find too so this pretty much sums up my what the heck Wednesday for this week um, I'll put a link and I'll put a list of all the candies that are gluten free and not just to go over what I went over but I just thought I'd do a fun video even though I'm not sure what I really am I'd just do a video with me uh, just up for Halloween and just to help you um, be safe this trick or treat and just in the future. So, hope this was helpful to you. I hope you enjoy this What the Heck Wednesday, and I hope I look forward to seeing you next week. Thanks for watching.